Hey guys, it's Queen Nisha, and in today's video, I will be reacting bring to episode two of We Cross Diva Live. So let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. Oh, she's cute. How they making me want some chips. Good thing I went to go and buy some chips. Oh, are we going to see the opening in this episode? Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, technically we saw this last week, but it was as the opening. I mean, the ending. But still, it's nice. Excuse me. Why the blue girl a light house and I ain't go? I didn't notice that. that you do we cross oh okay is it mainly because of the fact that your student council president okay Of course. <laughs> yeah, I think, Ray, if you were the center, I don't think... Oh, that looks so good. Yeah, but I think here or not, you you might be a better leader than Ray. <laughs> Come on, Aki, it'll be fine. I mean, we're only two episodes in, but Aki is best girl. I'm sorry.
what your group name or something. Uh, mm-hmm. Mm. Well, you need it by the end of this episode, right? <laughs> it shouldn't just be Ray's name. It's pretty. Simple in a way. I mean, her bed's not against a, like, a wall or something, so I would be hella afraid about falling off the bed. Well, one's very upbeat and positive. Both of them are positive, but Aki's very shy. Mm. I mean, damn, how the hell did they find that out so fucking quickly? Good. <laughs> I mean, DJ is the queen of YouTube. Deja, I love you. I think you're the best. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right, let's see. Hmm? Hmm. Hmm. Well, damn, Aki. But why would they want to go against you guys? I mean, it seems like Doc Note wants something about you, but... What? But didn't Hirana... Hirana 
did that on accident, right? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you can, you know, go to the heads and deregister until you get your name. She's just ready to go. Yeah, but how did I, you know... Wait! Nah, doctor, I don't know. Oh, God. Do you know that already? I mean, hold up, but isn't that cheating, though? Is it because of her skill, data, or ability? Mm-mm. They have to. But th- that's cheating! I mean, hold up. You, there should be something in the rule book, manual. You know, higher ups need to be in here. But like, hey, uh uh-uh. uh. But I bet you the first time, whoever they want to get someone, yeah, somebody would be like, hey, this raid. <laughs> and you know, them higher ups are like, no, it's fine. Exactly. Oh, 
Aki. Whatever that is, does it didn't sound good? Mm. You only have one coin left. Hmm? Oh, well, y'all been screwed. Mm. Did what surface? <laughs> well, I, I mean, at least it's good. It's something. Oh my god, he don't know. She looks more and more like Heart Cup to Sakura and it's so freaking cute.
I mean, but y'all broke the rules probably several times as well. I think that's the name of their group, No Limit. It has to be. Really, right? No limit. No limit. <laughs> That's it. No limit. It's perfect. Makes the most sense, of course. Honestly, this is, you know, this battle this week was a little bit better than last week's. I mean, last week's was good, but this, like establishing No Limit as a group together, you know, Ray isn't beating around the bush or bullshit or anything. She's 100% committed to Haruna and Aki, and I like that. Because, yes, before in episode one, when we met Ray, Ray was very, you know, there's no I in team. There's just me. There is nothing else. I don't give a crap about you. There ain't no we. <laughs> it's just me at the end of the day. I mean, because in episode one, she was very bitchy in a way and I think both Aki and Haruna you know changed her and especially when we found the, out the fact that you know all three of them are in the same class and such because of course what else is it gonna be but I think this is gonna be the start of a beautiful you know friendship slash relationship and teammate-ish maybe I don't know but I think it's gonna be really good for these three I think they're going to do their best. The sky is the limit for them. They can be anything they want to be and they can accomplish anything that they set their minds to, honestly. But yeah, the episode was good. I thought the battle was really nice, interesting. I mean, when you, honestly, because I was thinking about this ever since I watched episode one, if you kind of immediately don't compare it to the original We Cross and how We Cross is, you're going to instantly not really like this show. So, what I'm trying to do with this is not to do a lot of compare and contrast to the original We Cross series going into this because I don't think we're going to get um, the dark, scary moments like that made We Cross what it is today. I think this is just going to be a very cute, lighthearted, you know, typical girly girl, magical girl as show where the only trouble that they're going to get into is battles and stuff like that. I don't think like anything bad bad is going to happen maybe unless like No Limit gets to like the final boss or something. It just seems this is going to be like a very mellow show and honestly you know what I'm okay with that. I really have no problems with it. I think last week I kind of did but the more and more I sat and I thought about it and I was like okay I need to kind of go into this not comparing this because if I continuously compare it to the original series I think probably by maybe week three four or five knowing myself if I continued on that path I probably would have dropped this show but because of the fact is if I you know leave and not compare it to the original series of course I'm going to enjoy it more and I am honestly enjoying it more the characters and everything about this is really colorful because you know the original series was dark as hell and the things that happened in that series was very dark but not too too dark but yeah I really like the lightheartedness I like the opponents that you know no limit went into went against really 
I like Doctor. She was interesting. <laughs> I love her outfit and the drum set. I think that's an honest. I think you know what. Every group has an interesting thing or weapon that they use to fight. I mean, No Limit is the typical magical girl stuff. I mean, Haruna's using a wand. Um, Ray's using a sword and um, Aki's using her fist. So that's typical regular magical girl stuff. While you have this group using freaking band instruments. Like, <laughs> I would have never thought. But yeah, I think it's honestly really good. And I can't wait to see who goes against No Limit next week. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode two of We Cross Diva Live. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Matchless Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially, y'all, next Friday, Saturday for episode three. Bye, guys.